Hello, Alessia here. Today we're going to explore how to add classes as an attribute. And yes, a class is an attribute. If you inspect the site, you can see that classes are within the HTML element, same as ID and other custom attributes. But previously, Webflow didn't allow you to add the word class as the attribute name. So let's find out what this new capability allows you to do. In this video, we're going to cover how to add class within the attribute field and what this new superpower allows you to do. In the designer, I have styled two buttons, one with a class button and one with a class button underscore highlight. Next to them, I have a third button, just with a class button. What you can do is add existing Webflow classes within the custom attribute field. For example, let's see what happens if I add the class button underscore highlight. It pulls the CSS, which I've already defined within the Webflow style panel. The second option is to define your classes within your custom code. For example, if you want a wide button or align the text to the left, you can define the CSS within an embed or global styles. You can then add these classes within your attributes value field, depending on what you want the final result to be. The beauty of this is that all of the classes are treated as primary classes rather than combo classes. So you can remove any of them without having to worry of using the correct combination. Now, why would this open up new possibilities? Well, attributes can be controlled by the CMS or component props. So let's make my third button a component and let's link the class attribute to one of the props. This allows me to control the look of the button by adding classes. So now just one component can create multiple variants. And these can be defined by the CMS too and can relate to any element on the page. So you could have one hero component with the text aligned to the center and the items stacked, or you could have the same component having the text aligned to the left with two columns. I am curious to see what you will build next with this newfound superpower. And if you found this video useful, you know what to do. Otherwise, see you next time. Bye for now.